Last week, we heard from several of the stars from the movie Gifted, but we still have one more interview. Jim Ferguson sat down with the love interest. Right. You know, it, Jenny Slate, yeah. she's a comedian, and she does a uh, comedian, and she does so many voiceover things, uh, Zootopia, uh, Lego Batman, The Secret Life of, of Pets, that sort of thing, and, and she's just full of energy. And this was different for her because it's a serious role. She plays a teacher, and she's very serious in it, uh, does have some fun scenes, but she was just great to talk to. We're going to see a lot of her in the future, I'm sure. Here she is, yeah. You don't know? Wow, looks like someone needs school. Welcome to the beautiful state of Arizona. <laughs> Thank you. Looks like a classroom. <laughs> Congratulations on your performance. <clears throat> I was a high school teacher for 25 years. Mm. And in all the years that I was a teacher, I don't remember ever having a student that gifted. As, oh. <laughs> as young Bummer. McKenna, Mary, <laughs> you're a teacher in her school in first grade. Mm -hmm. uh, that's very rare to get a student like that. And you play that so well. Like, wow. You. you know. Yeah. I mean, it's she is, uh, you know, Mary, McKenna's character, is truly remarkable. You cannot, you can't look away. Um, that that's I think where my you know what my character experiences is, is I've just discovered something very precious mm -hmm. I have to make sure that it's being you know that that this talent that this little girl has is um, that she's able to be a whole person mm -hmm. while still being mm -hmm. a and, genius. and that's really your goal as a teacher is to help this child and I felt your interest in uh, the family the Adler family uh, the little girl and her her uncle was genuine. Yeah, I think so yeah. too. I, I mean, that's one of the loveliest things about playing Bonnie is that she's straightforward, she's confident, but she's very still. You know, mm -hmm. as a person, I'm pretty bouncy, and I don't, uh, I don't often feel like uh, somebody who wants to tell other people what to do or tell people what to do with their lives. I care for them in sort of different ways, but Bonnie really has to cross some lines, be a facilitator, and. Um, I really, yeah, she's yeah. a protector. That that's yeah. right, it, and it uh, it's a very nice way to. Mm -hmm. I don't want to give it away, mm. uh, but her caring for the uncle was important too, because mm -hmm. <laughs> there's a a nice touch of a love story there. There certainly yeah. is, um, yeah. There is many different types of love in this movie. And one of the questions that many of these characters face is, how do we navigate the complexity of this love and mm -hmm. these connections? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I, um, I like the entire cast. Octavia. Me too. <laughs> uh, 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 just a good cast that, to work with, I'm sure. Yeah, these actors are um, so incredibly talented. And I think to come into this group, for me, it was really important to be on my A game. Well, Jim, I know we've heard from a lot of the, the stars, and I know you reviewed this last week, but what did you really think about this movie as a whole? You know, I thought it was a wonderful family movie, a great story. Uh, the little girl is just tremendous. She's like Dakota Fanning was yeah. at that age. Uh, I liked it a lot. And, uh, you know, Octavia Spencer, uh, just a good cast and uh, a nice story, a nice, good, wholesome family story. Yeah. Well, and I, I liked the uh, interview with uh, McKenna Grace. She's so cute. Isn't she? Yeah. yeah. She really gave me a hug. when. <laughs> that is so great. And so this one you say is a really good uh, movie. And we're moving into another movie Friday, which you also say has a great cast. Yeah, I'm going to L.A. tomorrow to see okay. it. It's called The Promise. Yes. Christian Bale, uh, Isaac Hayes. I mean, I'm sorry. Oscar. Oscar Isaac. Yes. Uh, a young actress, a beautiful gal, Charlotte LeBon is her name. We'll have all of them next week. Uh, so... Yeah, I'm going to rush back with the interviews. I was going to say, tomorrow you see... <laughs> I, I see the movie in L.A., and I do the interviews on Wednesday, back Wednesday night, drop the interviews off Thursday, and there we go. So the first one we're going to hear is the director, right, Terry George? Right, Terry George, the director, will be next this coming Friday. This coming this Friday. This coming Friday. It's had great pre-reviews. I've seen uh, uh, trailers of it. It, it's the Ottoman Empire set in Paris. Beautiful story. I love Triangle. Well, travel safe. We'll see you back Always here. Do, Tina. We'll see you back here <laughs> on Friday to catch even more of Jim's Hollywood interviews. Log on to TucsonMorningBlend.com and search for Hollywood happenings.